Hello everyone. The point of sale pharmacy management will allow managing a pharmacy store with the point of sale where user can manage medicines, their inventory, invoices and alternative products. Once this module is installed, there are some configurations that we need to done. So for that, we need to get into the point of sale. Under that, you can see end settings of each and every shop. When we scroll down, there we can see end pharmacy management. We need to enable these options and we need to enable an advanced search. It allows for an advanced search and we can delete the orders and, and you can clear the order line. You can quick pay by using this and we have added the payment method right away here. And we have a views which is a list view as well as a grid view. Grid view is a normal point of sale view and we have the list view as advanced. Okay. Now let's save this one. And under pharmacy management, user can see a list of daughters can be created. Okay. And for each and every doctor creation, we need to enable is doctor option, which is available here. And you can see the pharmacy products. These are the pharmacy products as a sample we have created. Okay. And there I have enabled all the informations. And in the sales, I have added the categories. And in the pharmacy, we have added all that informations like diseases, medicine usage, side effects, precautions, manufacture, everything. Okay. And these are the things that we need to um, add right away here. Like manufacturing company needs to be created. And you can add that manufacturing company here. Okay. Here you can see I have created the manufacturing company. And I have created a list of diseases. And here I have created a medicine usage with the medicine name as well as the usage of it. And here you can add and side effects. There I have added the medicine name as well as the side effects. And you can add the precautions if needed. Okay. So once every configuration is done, now let's get into end point of sale. Now in this point of sale screen, you can see we are in the list view. We can use this as a grid view as well, which is a normal Odoo default one. Okay. Now let's make this as a list view. And here you can see an advanced search option where you can easily search based on that. Okay. And you can see based on the allergies and based on that medicine usage and you can filter based on the side effects. Okay. And you can filter based on the precautions as well. It will show and correct medicine from the list of medicine that we have created before. Okay. So let's remove all the things. So from here you can see these are the medicines that we have and based on the filter that we can filter which is an advanced filter that we have additionally added. Now let's add the product into the cart. Okay, I have added an paracetamol where you can see in discard option as well as a delete option which helps user to discard as well as a delete. And here you can see a doctor where you can add the doctor name here. Okay, now once this is done you can see a quick cash payment will be available here. So once you click on that it will automatically pay based on that payment method that we have added in the configuration. Now in the back end let's get into the point of sale and here you can see all the orders that we have created. So this is the order that we have placed now. So for each and every order user can see the doctor name right away here with an descriptions of it. Okay description of the product and also the payment everything will be seen in this order page. In this way, we can make use of this module to manage and pharmacy store with the point of sale. If you have any queries regarding this video, you can ask in the comment box. We will definitely solve your queries. And if you feel this video is helpful to you, you can like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more Odoo related updates. Thanks for watching.